It is a wood that men will kill for. This shootout is part of an escalating war between rangers in the national parks of Thailand and poachers who come to steal the giant rosewood trees growing there. It is a trade that is vast, organized and devastating to habitats across the Mekong countries of Southeast Asia and it's all happening to serve a booming market for this most prized luxury timber. Here on this trail in this national park in northeast Thailand there's a pop-up sawmill and this is where rosewood poachers have been last season they've come and chopped down a pretty large tree here and you can see the evidence of their visit their water bottles batteries and so forth and this shows that this is really where the story of the great rosewood theft starts in the dwindling forests of southeast asia and it's here that small bands of rangers like this one in thailand are battling against the odds to stop the flow of illegally logged timber across the border and then on a long journey which in some cases ends in the salons of China's new elite. The men go on days long patrols deep into the forests in an endless cat and mouse game with the poachers. They know danger can strike at any time and they must train to be on constant alert. <laughs> แรงมากก็คือเดินต้องการไม้ตัวนี้มากราคาก็ให้สูงเลยเป็นภาวะที่เราสูญเสียมากก็เพราะเขาให้ค่าจ้างแพงการลักลอบการตัดไม้ไป
Executives at the company who have spoken have denied that Tri Piap or his business empire are involved in any wrongdoing. In Thailand, rangers are still fighting and dying trying to protect dwindling stocks there. And in other places, such as the Cardamom Mountains, these magnificent trees and the ecology and communities around them have already all but disappeared. Michael Peel, Financial Times, Cardamom Mountains.